I have come to talk to you about a personal matter. After what I revealed to you, I was sure you would come back to find me. What would you like to know? You told me that I was born on one of your ships, of an islander captured on the island. We'd like to know about this woman's origins. I'm afraid I can't help you. I did not take part in those expeditions, and our old archives are far from here. Is there no one on Tia Fredi who can help us? Please. Very well. I do know an old captain who could perhaps help you out. Where can he be found? His ship is moored in the port of Hikmet, if I'm not mistaken. His name is Captain Lissandro. Thank you for your help, Admiral. Desarde? Yes, Admiral? Don't get too caught up in the past. That one in particular. Nothing good will come of it. Whether or not we choose to get caught up in it, Admiral, the past always catches up with us. Sadly, I'm paying the price of this. Okay. Well, now I gotta, gotta go talk to, uh, Lysandro. Uh, I gotta question the customs officer. I've got a whole bunch of shit to do. Where is this customs officer? Healer. Okay, hold on. Let's do that. Since we're here, solve a problem, get the XP, let me get lockpicking three and unlock that box next to my house. That's the plan. That's all I want. That's what I want for the day. Oh. Customs officer, you make things hard for me. Alright, you. Customs officer Alric. What can I do for you? Desarde. I'm the legate of the merchant congregation. I've been told of some issues with customs. I would like some clarification. I'm listening, your excellency. I was informed that customs was robbed. Yes, these thieves have quite the nerve. Someone even stole personal belongings this time. Since then, I've put all important things in the chest. But I lost the key. Probably on my way here. I was told that a shipment from the continent bound for the tavern had been seized as a precautionary measure. Uh, yes, it's possible. We seize cargo sometimes. To verify that all taxes to the town have been paid. Randomly? Without a prior formal order? I... No, I, I don't know. Perhaps we received a complaint. That happens sometimes. I suppose all entries are noted in your records. Naturally. But I assure you that we only do our job. It was all routine. Let me summarize. You have confiscated some goods, perhaps because of a report, but you're not sure. Then that same cargo was stolen from you, along with other things in your custody. Uh, exactly, Your Excellency. You are either the worst customs officer I've met or the biggest liar. Listen, Your Excellency, I made a mistake. It's true, I, I should not have ordered this seizure. In fact, it was late and uh, counting the crates would have taken me hours. I decided to postpone it. In the meantime, the goods were stolen. It's unfortunate, but I'm not useless. You haven't even informed the authorities of this robbery. This is all rather suspicious, Officer Auric. So I think it's necessary to conduct this inspection with a search. I... Please, Your Excellency. I'm sure the contents of this chest would be very informative. Maybe we should go to the docks to see if we could find the key that this scatterbrain has lost. Or we could just be good. A letter from Egon. And 25 wing legs. We will be waiting for you tonight at the quarry, which is near the northern gates. We hope that you will have explanations concerning the mistakes you made during your last operations. It would be a shame if we had to punish you. You're such lovely children. Ah, I see. So, were you satisfied with your inspection, sire? Absolutely. I found this letter in your chest. The signature on it seemed very interesting. I, I was sure I'd lost the key. I will explain. But I am trapped. And it's been like this for months. I am forced to pull off all kinds of tricks in order to settle an old debt. Egon. Yes, sir. 
Either I do what he says, or I lose my children. I've already paid off my debt a hundredfold, but he maintains his hold over me. And now I have no choice but to obey when he asks me to divert larger shares of cargo. Could you help me identify him? I'd like to, but I've never met him. He gives me his instructions in writing, or sends his men. He wrote the letter you found, or at least I think he did. I plan to put an end to this individual's activities, so anything you can tell me will be useful. I hope you manage it, Your Excellency, for the sake of my children. Maybe you could come to the meeting he's arranged tonight. Do you think he will come in person? I don't know. This is the first time I've received a notice like this. I fear he'll punish me for arousing the innkeeper's suspicions. He doesn't let anything get past him, you know. Very well, I will come. If only to avoid you paying the price for your stupidity. Thank you, Your Excellency. I'll meet you at the North Gate in the evening. No offense to our new friend. I'm not sure this Egon will come in person. I'd be surprised if he'd bother moving just to lecture a small fry in his business. Okay. That was a conversation that Kurt sh uh, probably should have been present for. And I'm starting to pick up on these things. It's not even starting to at this point. I'm picking up on these things. All right, North Gates. You have to wait till nightfall. I'm gonna guess. Ah, oh, there you are. Are you ready? Yeah. Yes. Let's go. We have a meeting next to the quarry. As we are early, we should be the first to arrive. Perfect. I'll hide until they get here. He will certainly not come alone. I beg you, don't wait to intervene if things go wrong. Be confident. I won't abandon you. You should get in position. He'll be here soon. Find a place to hide and secretly observe. <laughs> that was good. All right, place to hide. Probably in the quarry, right? Maybe here? This seems reasonable. Yeah, there we go. I'm so glad to see you. Because you owe us some explanations, don't you? I... Sir, le let me explain. I, I, I wanted to do well. I, I was just a little rushed and... Silence, fool. Not only have you been so clumsy with your angling that the quartermaster was informed, but in addition, you dared to plot with this legate, a noble that has already cost us dearly. Do you no longer love your children, Auric? You want us to get rid of them? Is that it? No, Mr. Egon, I beg you. Don't hurt them. I didn't have a choice. The Legert came for an inspection, but I didn't tell him anything. I swear. It's a shame, Alric. Egon loved you, but would have placed you with someone else soon enough. Someone smarter. Get rid of him. I don't want to hear from this little roach any longer. As for me, I'm leaving for Hikmet. Try to be discreet. This legate doesn't seem willing to let go. This poor man trusted us. We should go to his rescue. If we're going to help him, we will probably lose track of our man. Let's help. We told him we would. And he told us where we were headed. Or where he was headed. Oh, you, my life, Your Excellency. Don't mention it. Alas, all this was useless. This man was not Egon. I'm not sure that it's a person, Your Excellency. It may be the name given to the leaders of the gang. I don't know. But I will never be at peace until you arrest them, that's for sure. That's exactly what I'm trying to do. But how can I find this man now? He said he was going back to Hikmet. Which is where he sends the stolen alcohol. I'm sorry. 
I have not been completely honest with you. I could have told you that earlier, but I knew that without your protection, I would not survive. The deliveries are sent to a dispensary outside the town. No doubt to avoid arousing suspicion. A dispensary? But what are they doing with all this alcohol? I'm not sure, Your Excellency. But you'll no doubt find out if you go there. Well, at least the fright Egon gave Auric managed to loosen his tongue. Okay. Well. It's nice I was just able to jump down here. Because he would have died if I didn't. Alright. To the dispensary. I think I can just leave right up here. After I kill some... <laughs> some banditos. Hello. There was two. Oh, is that it? I still... No, I, I still got some... Battle loot going on here. Oh, hello. Easy bandits. You guys got that. Easy. All right. To heck, Met. We got a few things to do here. Find a dispensary, question Captain Lissandro, and ask for help with the best doctor. So we'll do three things while we're here, which is good. Good for me. Oh, I could sell some, sell some things right here. I have a bunch. Claymore the Lieutenant. No, I think I, I just had the best stuff now. Okay. Uh. Get rid of those. Get rid of all these. And we're done. There you go. Actually, there's probably a whole bunch of whole bunch of things I can get rid of. I mean, I'm at 166 right now. I don't need this anymore. I need that. And, yeah, there you Everyone's stuff is covered here. I mean, I don't have to carry this with me. I could just drop that in a, in a box. I think. Hold on, what are you using, Kurt? Commander's Curious. Yeah, I'll figure out what to do with that. Actually, I... Well, it's unique, which means it's... Probably useful. I mean, I can wear that. I don't know if I will, though. Alright. Um... Back to here. Armored boots. Metal of San Mateus. That's healing. Magic regen. Can I give that to Kurt? Yes, I can. There you go. Oh, shit. I fucked up. Man, I just sold... Give me that back. I messed up. <laughs> I meant to put that on Kurt. I, I think I just lost a bunch of money doing that, too. Oh well. Oh, you incompatible with uh, not enough points of willpower. Magic regen. You know what? Here. You use that. And you use that. A little, little bit of upgrades. 
Small amount. Let us thank the enlightened that a captain who took part in these expeditions is right here on the island. It is indeed a stroke of luck. I hope he remembers my mother. Do not worry. If his memory fails him, he may have kept his diary from that time. Yes. I'll tell you what. Keeping a diary is actually very helpful, especially in a professional sense. Because I constantly forget things. I don't actually have a diary, I just keep it to a to-do list, but you can usually you can use them kind of interchangeably. Um, like if I forget what I'm talking about with somebody, it's very helpful to just write it down. And having it all in one book is really helpful. Like just just having a note of what uh, oh geez, hello, everybody. Just having a these note. Islanders are drunk, and these guards don't look that official. I think we found where all the alcohol reserves on the island end up. Are they trying to get Islanders uh, drunk here? Hello, everybody. On your way. There's nothing for a highness here. As for you, savage, if you're looking for something to drink, go to my colleague over there. What? How dare you? Sorry, but we're entering all the same. Oh yeah, we'll soon see about that. Okay. Oh yeah. This is the man we saw at the quarry. We must stop him. I got something good out of that. That guy had some, uh, some pretty good things. Hello, everybody. What are you doing here? You're done. Surrender. You are under arrest. What am I accused of? You are a high-ranking member of a criminal organization that has named itself Egon. And you did not hesitate to order a murder. So, even though the attempt failed, the gallows await you. Unless you decide to reveal everything you know. I won't say a word. I won't give you anyone. I'd rather die. If you really thought so, we would not be talking. You will be taken to New Serene. Manfred will know how to make you talk. Okay. Manfred. Well, we didn't kill two people, we just kind of left them there, but we, uh, did that pretty quick. Just slammed our way in here. Hello. Animals that do not want to fight, they just want to sleep. Yes. Moo. Or bad. I can't jump over that way. We'll find that. Turn around. Back around. Alright, so I gotta go back. At some point. We have a few things to do. Gotta talk to a doctor. Pretty sure I've already talked to this doctor. Or I talked to no, I talked to the other one in San Mateus. That's my house. At the fiery flasks, you'll find Here, I actually have something for you. What can I serve, my vape? Sell. Uh there you go. And there you go. I know it had stuff on it, but I don't care. I can't use those, so get rid of them anyway. I was honored by your visit. Please come back. Can I go in this door? Brutes, leave me. I will follow you nowhere. Come now, be reasonable. Our people require the talent of a doctor, and we would prefer to have the best. But an accident is quick in coming. 
We won't want to have to settle for second best. I should intervene. These thugs don't seem to care about her well-being. Well, well. What do you want? You need to leave the doctor alone. Is that so? Well, let's see if you can live up to your gigantic mouth. Ah!